Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Nihility Only. In today's episode, we will be quite literally maxing out all of our characters. This means 80 light cones, every single character. They're already all level 80. We are going to be getting 10, 10, 10 traces on all all of our characters and get them the best relics possible and of course get idol on six on every single character in the game okay that last one was a lie but also after that we will be taking on the new honkai star rail endgame apocalyptic shadow also, if you're not already, do make sure to subscribe to the channel. Only a small percentage of you are actually subscribed to the channel, and it really helps me out when you do. I put a lot of time and effort into these videos, so if you could just go down, click that little subscribe button, and let's get in to today's video. Mm, boing. Hey. Man, I really wanted to do the story for today's video, but unfortunately, there is no boss fight at the end of today's story. It's just Topaz. Hanging out and partying on a ship with a bunch of her little numby friends. This is actually really adorable, I won't lie. Anyways, yeah, we won't be doing story today. Because if there's no boss fight, there's really no incentive for me to do the story. So we're going to do other things today. And the first thing is what I'm most excited for. We are maxing out every single character. Now, all our characters are already level 80. I should star all of them. That's a new feature that they added. Let me do that. All right, there we go. We got my nine favorite characters up top there. All their light cones should also already be level 80, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, they are. That is really nice to look at. I won't lie. But you know what isn't maxed out is all of their traces. We are going to get every single last character to 10, 10, 10 today. Starting with Welt. First 10. Second 10. We're not upgrading his normal attack. There's legitimately no incentive to do that. Acheron is already 10, 10, 10. Kafka is now 10, 10, 10. Silverwolf, 1, 10. 2, 10s. Three tens, and she is now ten, ten, ten. Sampo, one ten. Ah, shoot! I have to go kill you. Okay, let's do that. I have to get every single ten today. We will be doing that, and for the sake of the video, let's use Nihility only against this boss. I haven't fought this boss since like episode five of the series. Let's run our Acheron team today. Acheron, Silverwolf, Welt, and Pela. Let's see if we can do this. This might actually be kind of difficult, to be honest. Gotta get some defense shred on them. Even more defense shred. And now we shred them. Like you do. Oh my gosh, this character is so good. <laughs> oh, I love Acheron. There is nothing in the world that will not make me love that character. Welt, number one sustainer. A bop. And let's win the fight. Gonzo, let's go. Should be everything we need right there. Plus the two god pieces. Uh, not terrible and not terrible. Sampo, you are now going to be 10 and one second. Bro, I have so many of these. 10, huge. We keep moving. Next up, Pela, you are now going to be crap. You need the ice queen again. Okay, one more time. One last time, plus god piece number five. Oh, Pela, you are now going to be 12 because we have idol on six. 12 and uh, oh my material exchange. Hell yeah, we don't need whatever these bullets are. They're for big boot. And that's the last number 12. Huge. We now have one, two, three, four, five, and six maxed out characters. That leaves three remaining characters. Gwenyphon, Black Swan, Luca. Now, I've kind of encountered something as we were doing this, and I've realized I have no more tracks of destiny. And unfortunately for me, there's not too many ways to get these other than in the Starlight Shop, which is possible if we do get a couple more Undying Embers, which I do just happen to have some Star Rail Passes. Let's use these quickly. Maybe these can give us something good. Uh, probably not, but we'll see it through. Nihility. Nihility. That ain't Nihility. Oh, Anaherda. How cool. We got five more though. Five more. 
Number one, nothing. Number two, nothing. Number two. Number three, nothing. Four, nothing. Five, surely? Ah, it's also nothing. Now, I would use my Stellar Jades on this just so we could get some more Undying Embers. However, I'm sure you're all aware that we need to save our Stellar Jades because they're is a brand new Nihility character coming out. Now, I haven't actually talked about this on Nihility only. I have made a whole video on this character because I've been aware of this for a while now, but this is the biggest character to ever come to this account. A Nihility healer has been confirmed for this series, and we're saving up hard for him. We're gonna need this guy for sure. He may have debatably my least favorite design in the entire game, but who cares? All right, let's do Black Swan next then. We can get one more here, level nine, and another level nine. And we're at a point again where we are out of Tracks of Destiny. This reward is kind of difficult to get. I need, and I need three more to finish Black Swan. This is pain. All right, let's try to finish this battle pass until we can get this level 15 one right here. That seems to be our best bet. And one thing we can actually do to get some points on that is doing a pop elliptic shadow which we were gonna do anyways hello there why so shy all right so i'm not sure how difficult this will be we're just gonna kind of figure it out as we go stage one should not be too bad i hope luckily they do actually have um dot based effects which is kind of huge or at least they do for one side they don't for the other for bottom half, we're probably going to have to go Acheron team, I imagine, for sure. Acheron, Silverwolf, Welt, Pela. And then top half, we're going to have to go our Kafka team, which is Kafka, Black Swan, Gwenyphon, and then probably Sampo. And let's see if this works. We best hope we can at least beat one stage because if we can't, um, we're going to have a really rough time today. Let's see how stage one goes. We did max out like half of our characters, so I'm praying that we do okay. Oh gosh. Oh, it just broke immediately. That works. Another one gone. Okay, nice. Oh, and Gepper just immediately dies. Ah. Oh, okay, the first stage might be really easy. Let's just uh, skip past this part. Okay, we are done stage one. Stage two should be a little bit harder. We're going to run the same teams, and let's go again. Let's run her back, boys. Come on. This time, we're probably going to take a little more damage, and the things just aren't going to die straight up, which is uh, a bit of a problem, but we'll figure it out. We always do. Now, Gepard actually gets turns. Oh, gosh. Use that. Nice. One broke. Woo. Okay, good. Other one broke. Huge. Don't freeze. Let's go. We have no way of protecting against freeze. If they freeze us, it's just kind of screwed. Okay, now what we do, Kafka Burst, I think we should kill Kokolia. Almost. We get all our Burst back too, that's awesome. Oh, sweet, second side, huge. Big, 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 big. I used that way too early. Oh, she didn't even spawn the pillars yet. What am I doing? I'm throwing. Spawn your pillars. There we go. We get all the DOT onto the pillars. And then what we're immediately going to do is use Kafka Ultimate on them. And I'm just hoping that's going to kill them. I should have used Sampa Burst on them though. That's really unfortunate. That being said, they all broke. <laughs> That's awesome. They all broke anyways. It didn't even matter. Let's just use all of our E's and completely evaporate her. Oh, we're so close. Let's go. She broke. And we get all our bursts straight back. And I think Kafka Burst should just be able to kill her. Boom. Let's go. She's dead. Pretty good time too. Second side. Let's get it. Oh, gosh. These guys just do damage immediately. There's, like, nothing I can do to stop me from taking this damage. It's just inevitable. Oh, man. That hurts. There we go. And now we can hurt him again. Oh, gosh. Stop. I had to use this. I got scared. They just do so much damage. There we go. We get all our damage boost, though. That's big. And we're going to slow him. Never mind. We, we can't slow the boss. That is sad. Oh, gosh. And he's going to get another turn. Uh-oh. Okay, good. We're back. We're back, boys. Say goodbye to the boss. Oh my gosh, Acheron. Acheron. Oh, 400k. Let's go. Flow all these guys. Do this as well. Can I not target our Genty? I can't target our Genty. That is cringe. That being said, we still killed three of them. That's big. And another one. Now we go for our Genty. 
Oh, I really can't let him get that move off. I don't know if I'll have much of a choice, though. Maybe I can kill him with Akron before he gets it. I mean, we do have a lot of defense shred. Oh, I think she got it. Oh, she did. Woo. Let's go. Three stars as well. Claim all of that. 360 Jade. And I think that's going to give us the achievement. Boom. Level 10. Not enough, though. We need level 15. I guess for the rest of the levels, let's just spend a bunch of Trailblaze power. Come on, tell me I got it. Shoot, only level 11. Oh, guess we're clearing Pure Fiction 2 today then. Let's go. We sweeping everything today, boys. Might as well do it all. How fun. We are defeating every last bit of endgame content today, no matter the cost. Let's go. Get a Macron. Oh, endgame content is such a joke with Nihility only. If you're doing the earlier stages, we'll get to the hard stuff later. To be honest, all I really need to do here is just click buttons and I win. I mean, it really is just that simple. We do 600,000 damage with Akron. I mean, I just don't think anything here will even compete with us. So, uh, yeah, let's transcend the fabrics of time again. Yeah, we got, uh, the, the max score. That's not too shocking. Uh, we do need to get three more stars, however, to get the EXP. Level three, here we come. Oh, gosh, this one looks a lot harder. Okay, well, we'll see how far we can get. We just need 60,000 points. Might be a little more strategy to this one. I got the one with more speed and increases our allies damage for the Akron side. Hopefully that's enough. We're gonna find out now. Here we go. Get quantum weakness on you. I mean, you are already weak to like all my things, but I need you to be weak to even more things. And then Akron, I need you to go. You still do a crap ton of damage. Okay, that's what I'm used to. 400k, good enough. Defense shred, oh gosh, they're all gonna get a turn. Oh no. If the enemies ever get a turn, I'm just screwed. Uh-oh. Just those little bits of damage. They're going to come in really important later. We're going to save Akron Burst for the next half. That's important. Because there's no reason to use it on just two enemies. It feels like a bit of a waste. But we are going to finish off that one there. Good stuff. Now we can use it. 800,000 damage. Oh my goodness. We've, we've almost hit a million. It's very close. Give us energy. Yeah. Oh, you gave it to Akron. Okay, well that doesn't help. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Come on. 900,000. Bro, we're getting up there in numbers. It's only a matter of time before we hit 100. Give us energy. Yay. Give us energy. Stop giving it to Silverwolf. We can't use our burst yet. Oh gosh, we're almost out of turns. I didn't even I wasn't even looking at the turn order. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, then we have to use Akron burst now. Oh my goodness. When did we get to zero in the turn order? Oh, oh gosh. We only got 20,000 points. Oh, that's bad. I didn't realize we were so low in the turn order. Well, we're going to have to clutch up here. 40,000 points. That means we have to beat the whole thing. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Well, that might not happen. We'll figure it out. I mean, as long as we can just get DOT on everything, they should just die themselves, surely, right? Yep. Yep. Yeah, they just kind of die themselves. I mean, I don't even have to really do anything. We might get 40,000 here. Who knows? We're up to 30k already, 32k. That's pretty good. Unfortunately, we have to get max though. We do have three turns left and we are on the second wave. That's the positive. And we haven't taken like any damage. And the wolf is dead. And he brings up his allies and then they die. And we're getting free energy too, or whatever that is. Uh, I don't actually know what he gives us there. Oh, we just passed turn three. Okay, one more side to go. Just one more. This is intense. We need to get the full 20,000 points from this. Uh-oh. This is not looking good. Stop targeting down Black Swan. What does she do to you? Bro, they're just hard targeting. Uh-oh. Oh, they didn't do as much as I thought they would, to be honest. Oh, gosh. How did he live? Coffee's getting double targeted, too. 53,000 points, though. We're only 6,000 away. And we have a full turn left. And they're dying. Oh, is it just the monkey left? Oh, it's just the monkey left. Just a little bit more. Let's go. We got 60,000. 60,000 on the nose. We got it. Oh my goodness. Claim our rewards. Look at all that. And it's going to put us a little bit further towards getting the track of destiny. Now, unfortunately, 
we have hit the weekly exp limit which is really sad so looks like we're gonna have to wait a little bit longer until next week so i guess we'll just break the fabrics of time again and uh i'll see you guys next week hey guys we're back it's been a week now and i believe this is reset yeah we can now get more exp let's go finally it only took a whole week let's go and that means we can get our final trace for the day we will upgrade the black swan ultimate now i did say we would max out every character today uh unfortunately that wasn't completely true we maxed out about 80 percent of our characters but unfortunately for luca when i Finn, and black swan it's gonna take a little bit longer because we just don't have the tracks of destiny and it's going to take me about another month or two to save up the rest of them to upgrade those characters. But that being said, I'm still satisfied with almost all of our characters getting to 10, 10, 10. It's been honestly a long time, but I think now officially I can say that this account has reached its heat we have all of our characters on really good relic set with pretty decent stats all of them have 134 speed or above akron has an amazing crit ratio all of them have really good light cones in fact we actually almost have every nihility light cone in the game to be completely honest this account is almost complete so the only thing we have really left to do is take on some of the hardest content like for example the end game of apocalyptic shadow which we already did some of these earlier stages but i want to try the two harder stages mainly floor three because i've heard floor four is basically impossible if you don't have firefly but i want to see if we can do floor three same teams as before we run it back and this time it's going to be even harder how fun it only gets harder as we go let's see if we can still keep up with it oh my gosh they do so much more damage oh no and she gets three turn okay uh <laughs> oh no this will not be fun bro sampo's on half his hp we're barely 10 seconds in oh gosh she froze kafka oh no bro breaker please oh no he gets another turn he got a shield are you kidding me oh there she goes and she has no weaknesses oh my gosh i i don't know if this is possible oh my score 138 that is the most depressing thing i've ever seen one more try i have to give it one more attempt I mean, maybe we can make it past the first half. If we break both icicles, I think there's a chance. And if we don't get frozen, which is just guaranteed to happen every time because we have zero way of preventing it. And we just have no way of breaking Geppard either. Like, Kafka's the only one who can even hit his weaknesses. And he brings freaking toughness protection. And there she goes. Oh my. Okay. We somehow got worse. Well, maybe no two will be easier. I mean, we do have an Acheron. Surely the end game content can't be that hard. Yeah, look at us. We're tanking those hits. Oh my gosh. We got him this time, I believe. Come on, blow him. Now we use Acheron first and hopefully we can break these things. Good stuff, we broke him. And there we go, look at that. Hopefully he doesn't spawn for ah ah of course uh the sad reality ah acheron <laughs> this is so sad man unfortunately for us they don't really make end game content that really fits the nihility only challenge and this is a perfect example of it even with all our characters maxed out full light cones full traces full relics unfortunately this endgame content is still too hard, even for our best account possible. And this is where I kind of want to throw back to you guys for the end of the video, because I am starting to question what I can really do with this series going forward. Obviously, we're going to roll for the new characters and stuff, but I've kind of come to a point where I feel like I've done everything I can possibly do to build every single character. And still, I'm finding myself struggling with the content. So I just want to hear from you guys. What do you want to see from this series? Let me know in the comments below, whether that be story content going forward, just defeating the bosses 
or if you want to see me throw my head at a wall doing the memory of chaos or just covering new characters i'd be really interested to know so you know what it's a little sad but hopefully in the next update when we get our nihility healer we get a little bit closer to our goal of completing some of the harder content but anyways for today that's gonna be all for me thank you guys so much for watching and i hope to see you all in the next one peace